Hey guys, what's up? I'm Rohit Pran, host of Intellect Digest, and this is a quick follow-up video on the UU Euphoria, where we have got very commonly asked questions or frequently asked questions on this, and I'm gonna answer five of these questions in this video, which includes USB OTG support, notification LED, on bezel buttons, double tap to wake up, and does the camera have flash? So let's start with the most common question that I'm getting. That is the USB OTG support, whether it supports USB OTG or not. Many people suggested me that there is a known bug in Cyanogen Mode 12 where uh, it does not detect USB OTG. But if I install ES Explorer, it will show me USB OTG. So what I'm gonna do is that I have already installed ESX File Explorer and I'm just gonna hit on local here which shows what all devices are connected. And if you look closely, it is showing me uh, the SD card one which is the external SD card that I have installed on this phone which you can see under the hood so there is one SD card that I have installed there is internal memory which is the second partition and I am gonna connect uh, a USB OTG pen drive followed by a USB OTG cable with a pen drive to see whether it detects the same or not so let's start with the same and uh, I'll move it to the local view here so that you can look closely there is home page home device storage sd0 which is the internal memory and sd card 1 which is the uh, sd card that i have installed so this is the usb otg drive and here i plug this let's wait for a few seconds if it shows up and it does not show up so the usb otg is not supported here and just to give you uh, clarification that this USB OTG pen drive works let me plug it into this uh, Galaxy S6 Edge that we have got here so I'm plugging the same drive here let me clear the notifications first here and I'm plugging the same drive in here and as soon as I plug I see a notification on this phone telling me that there is an external file, uh, USB drive that has been connected so there is USB OTG uh, support on this one but not on the uh, Euphoria. Just to give you a, uh, another test, let me connect a standard USB pen drive with a USB OTG cable and there is no change here as well. Just to give you a clarification, I'll take you into phone storage setting and show you what all drives it is detecting here. So we go into storage and you will find internal storage you will find SD card but there is no USB external drive or USB storage which is here so it is clear that this phone on this software does not support USB OTG maybe in future software updates uh, uh, Euphoria may support it but at this point the build that we are running which is uh, Cyanogen Mode 12 with the Lollipop 5.0.2 which I can show you here it does not work the exact build number is YNG1TBS103 which uh, you can see on your screen right now. So it does not work for us, uh, it is confirmed the USB OTG support is not there on UU Euphoria. And second most commonly asked question to us was whether it has a notification LED or not. And it does not have a notification LED, we tested it, we plugged in a charging cable, no light glows up. We gave a missed call we gave some uh, unread messages to this phone and nothing blows up so there is no notification led anywhere that we can see on this phone so it does not support led notifications out of the box third question was related to whether it supports on bezel buttons or not and unfortunately it does not support we saw a presentation by euphoria uh, u at the launch event and we found that there was some configuration to buttons that you could do and we misunderstood because we were watching a presentation on Cyanogen which suggested that there are buttons which can be moved to the bezel but this phone does not support that. What it supports instead is that it gives you option to edit the button layout so you can add more buttons here if you want you can add a search button etc. So you can uh, make changes to the layout of uh, these buttons here which will remain on screen and there are no on bezel buttons so there are no buttons on the body of the phone. All you can do is make customization and changes to the on screen buttons as per your requirements. Next question is regarding the double tap to wake up feature and yes this phone does have double tap to fake, uh, wake up but it is not enabled out of the box so you will not find this feature on uh, the phone when you take it out of the box and you need to tap slightly harder which I have noticed here 
to enable this feature you have to go to settings and display and light settings and here you find a setting which says double tap to wake up you need to turn on the setting to use this feature and also there is double tap to sleep but you have to double tap on the status bar only which is right here on top so you can double tap here it will uh, make the phone to go into sleep and to wake up the display you have to double tap on the screen a bit harder because uh, it's slightly harder than usual which we have found on other phones uh, but it does work next question was whether the camera has flash and the quick answer is yes it does there is a flash in this ring they call saturn ring uh, you calls it a saturn ring and it does light up when there is requirement you can forcefully turn the flash on you can put the flash on auto mode and you can also put uh, the flash on forcefully off mode so you have the flash settings right here uh, and it does work well this is all we have on a quick roundup of frequently asked questions and we have done a lot of videos on the U Euphoria. You can check out the videos in the playlist. The link is provided in the description section below this video. If you enjoyed watching this quick video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up by pressing the like button below. And for latest video updates, make sure you hit the subscribe button. I hope to see you in my next video. This is your host Rohit Kurana signing off. Thanks for watching.